Now, you've been actually searching for 20 years for this nurse, correct? I actually tried through Albany Med about almost 20 years ago to see if they had any idea who this woman was pictured with me. Give us a little bit of backstory as to why you were in the hospital. I mean, you were only three months old back at the time in 1977, correct? I was placed on a couch because I was on the brink of pneumonia, and my parents put a hot steam humidifier on the floor next to the couch. Apparently, at the time, I had not yet rolled over. And, of course, that day would be the fateful well, moment where I decided I'm going to roll over. Of and I landed right on it. Suffering uh, the burns, and uh, this was the nurse that was caring for you. Why did you decide to search for her? Well, you know, you carried your picture around with your entire life, never knowing who this person is. And, I mean, the pictures I have, they're going to touch you. I mean, they were just beautiful pictures, and it, I really just wanted to put a name and a voice and a person to who this was pictured with me. Well, she wasn't very old, uh, judging from the picture at the time, was she? No, she said she was about 21. She was only um, old for about two years. That's amazing, and even more amazing is what she turned out to currently be doing. Yeah, after 20 years of searching, you finally decide to turn your search to Facebook, and holy cow, two days later... You not only have a name, but you found her, you've talked to her, and she may be driving to Albany to see you? Yep, it's a tentative date for the 29th to come to Albany, yeah. That's crazy! I know. (laughs) Who's this mysterious nurse? Yeah, she's uh, the vice president of Casanova College. Amazing. And what's more amazing is her name is Susan Berger. She carried the same picture with her. I mean, it's it stayed with her this entire time, and she didn't think you remembered her, you didn't think she remembered you, and I can't believe it. Yeah, apparently she told me that uh, she's spoken of me quite often. Um, All of her children know of me. Wow. Uh, Her family, friends. (laughs) That is insane. And your story's gone viral. I've seen it everywhere. Yeah, I've had people from California contact me. I mean, literally, it was probably less than 12 hours by the time it went viral and actually hit the news. I walked into work, and my coworkers were like, oh, my God, you're on the news. And I was like, what are you talking about? They're like, you have to come look at this. I had no idea. Well, congratulations. We're glad you guys are reunited. And thank you so much for taking the time this morning, driving on the way to work to share this amazing story. Got to love Facebook, right? Got to love it. There is actually some good that can come from Facebook. Imagine that.